What is Mormonism? What do Mormons believe? We're going to answer those questions. To start, we want to clarify that all references made here are cited in the article on our website. The Mormon religion, Mormonism, whose followers are known as Mormons and Latter-day Saints, was founded less than 200 years ago by a man named Joseph Smith. He claimed to have received a personal visit from God the Father and Jesus Christ, who told him that all churches and their creeds were an abomination. Joseph Smith then set out to restore true Christianity and claims his church to be the only true church on earth. The problem with Mormonism is that it contradicts, modifies, and expands on the Bible. Mormons believe that there are, in fact, four sources of divinely inspired words. The Bible, as far as it is translated correctly, the Book of Mormon, which was translated by Smith and published in 1830, Doctrine and Covenants, containing a collection of modern revelations, and the Pearl of Great Price, which is considered by Mormons to clarify doctrines and teachings that were lost from the Bible. Mormons believe the following about God. He has not always been the supreme being of the universe, but attained that status through righteous living and persistent effort. They believe God the Father has a body of flesh and bones as tangible as man's. Brigham Young taught that Adam was actually God and the Father of Jesus Christ, although this teaching has been abandoned by modern Mormon leaders. In contrast, Christians know this about God. There is only one true God. He always has existed and always will exist. He was not created but is the creator. He is perfect and no one else is equal to him. God the Father is not a man, nor was he ever. He is spirit, and spirit is not made of flesh and bone. Mormons believe that there are different levels or kingdoms in the afterlife, the celestial kingdom, the terrestrial kingdom, the telestial kingdom, and outer darkness. Where mankind will end up depends on what they believe and do in this life. In contrast, the Bible tells us that after death we go to heaven or hell based on whether or not we had faith in Jesus Christ as our Lord and Savior. As believers, after death, we are with the Lord, but unbelievers are sent to hell. When Jesus comes the second time, we will receive resurrected and glorified bodies. There will be a new heaven and a new earth for believers, and unbelievers will be thrown into an everlasting lake of fire. There is no second chance for redemption after death. Mormon leaders have taught that Jesus' incarnation was the result of a physical relationship between God the Father and Mary. Mormons believe Jesus is a God, but that any human can also become a God. Mormonism teaches that salvation can be earned by a combination of faith and good works. Contrary to this, Christians historically have taught that no one can achieve the status of God, only He is holy. We can be made holy in God's sight through faith in Him. Jesus is the only begotten Son of God and is the only one ever to have lived a sinless life. Jesus and God are one in essence, Jesus being the only man who existed before physical birth. Jesus tells us it is impossible to get to heaven by our own works and that only by faith in Him is it possible. Clearly, there is only one way to receive salvation, and that is to know God and His Son, Jesus. Receiving salvation is not done by works, but by faith. We can receive this gift no matter who we are or what we have done. Salvation is found in no one else, for there is no other name under heaven given to men by which we must be saved. Although Mormons are usually friendly, loving, and kind people, they are deceived by a false religion that distorts the nature of God, the person of Jesus Christ, and the means of salvation. And that answers the questions, what is Mormonism and what do Mormons believe? Research these questions further on our website, gotquestions.org. Be sure to click subscribe and check out these other questions.